Hey guys, Beard of Pop here. We're here with part three of this unboxing with Dick Star once again. Stay tuned. Alright guys, so let's get to unboxing the last of these pops and checking them out. They've all been pretty cool so far and uh, just doing a little uh, look in ourselves on our break. And, uh, yeah, I think, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do alright with some of these pops. And uh, this one is an Elder Scrolls, the Nord. Just Nord there. Um, he's a pretty cool looking pop. He's pretty detailed. Another one of your favorites. Oh, look at that. But this one's actually a little bit cooler because it's the Love Ranger. So it's not actually exactly a person pop. It's just a person pop painted differently. And um, it's actually a Best Buy exclusive, which most of their exclusives are video games. But um, yeah, it's another Fortnite pop. I'm uh, filling up my Fortnite collection <laughs> slowly but surely over here. I can't like got a big one. I can't believe that there's a Billy Idol pop. I I've seen it before and I knew they came out with it, but you know, I have a Kurt Cobain pop. And you know, I know, I know the dude's rolling over in his grave. Oh, of course, man. Of course. <laughs> the minute they're like, okay, you can make a pop. And I got an Angus Young pop, too. Now, guys, this is one of the reasons I bought this box is because I didn't have this guy. And I just always have thought he's cool. And it's just something you see that you never get. This is a Baymax Hot Topic Diamond Exclusive 6-inch. Um... I'm not sure how much the uh, Hot Topic sticker is going to take away from the value of this guy, but uh, he's uh, he is cool. Check him out. He's pretty cool. And check it, it's diamond, so it's all glittery. Well, and so you said that would literally take off yeah, that's money? just a joke. Oh, okay, okay. Because, like, Hot Topic has exclusives, right? And they'll do the exclusives to death. Like, they'll release 50 of them, or, like, they'll release thousands, and then everybody buys them up and they're gone, and then the price will go up, 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 and then all of a sudden, three days later, oh, restock, mm, and then their okay. shelves are full yep. of them, and then the same thing happens, and then people realize, yeah, like, there's one, the Dark Phoenix Chase from Marvel, and when it came out at first, people were like, we're not going to be able to get the Hot Topic exclusive. We're not going to be able to get the Chase. And the price was inflated for the first month. Like, the Chase was hundreds of dollars. And then they just kept dropping them and dropping okay. them. And people have seen videos where, like, people buy a ton of them just to see how many Chases they get. So now the Chase is more worth, like, 60 or 65 Well, not still, like, it's, it's not terrible. Hell, but yeah. It's a lot of money. <laughs> This is a good guy right here, guys. It's the Chase Phillip from uh, South Park. That's a uh, pretty cool one right there. Mm -hmm. um, it's a Canadian pop. So, uh, hey, Magoo, we got one of your buddies right here. <laughs> yeah, one of your buddies. I know this one. This is the FYE Masters of the Universe uh, exclusive trap jaw. Um, I think I have him. He was on sale at FYE, I believe, for two dollars for a while. Oh. But now he's all out. So um, you know how the price goes up, and uh, I haven't really been talking much about the condition because they've all been really good. I mean, there hasn't been any issues with them, so I just was sticking with pointing out if they weren't. What was that one? Oh, I know you don't like people much, but that's a good one. It is. I got some strange, a few Stranger Things pops. So it's Lucas from Stranger Things. It's the new wave of Stranger Things that came out right before the new season. Um, he's pretty cool, and so are the other 640 Stranger Thing pops they came out with in this wave. Um, I have a few, but I'm not going to collect them all because there's a lot of them. There is a lot of Stranger Thing pops, and there's like the Demi Gordon. There's like. So many pops of the Debbie Gordon. There's like the big versions? ones, oh, oh no gold way. ones, and exclusive ones, and ones like, see how this makes sense. The Demi Gorgon that's the chase, the more valuable one, which isn't that valuable, the mouth is closed. But the regular Demi Gorgon, the mouth's open. You'd figure it would be the opposite. Yeah, with all the extra It's the detail. same with this little Shop of Horrors one. 
for uh, yeah, Audrey. Audrey, Audrey too. And the only difference is the chase has like a couple drops of blood on the snout. That's it. That's it. Well, you see in there, it's cool, you know. but it's it. Oh, guys. Look at this. It is a uh, 2019 Star Wars Galactic Convention Darth Maul. One of the few from this year that isn't gold. Um, got this one over there because I do have the 2019 Galactic Star Wars ones. But um, he's a cool one. He was uh, the one you could get from Walgreens. So um, it's amazing he's in good shape. Yeah, I think, like you said, a lot of these have been in really good shape. Yeah. Yeah. And this is um, Five Night at Freddy's, the Twisted One Ella. It's a GameStop exclusive for uh, Pop Books. So that's a pretty creepy looking one right there. It's pretty cool. They just keep coming. <laughs> they just they just keep coming. It's like a store over here. If it wasn't already like this behind me, um, a lot of pops, guys. Me spending quite a bit of time uh, putting some stuff on Macari, but uh, just make sure down below, check it out. There'll be a lot of good pops on there. Then look at this one. This is uh, Miss Who from A Wrinkle in Time. It's a, a pretty cool pop. It's uh, in pretty good condition like the rest have been. And um, I've never really seen this movie. Um, I know this is the one that Oprah's in. But uh, the dress is kind of interesting. What's that one? Oh, um, the Star, oh it's Wars Star Wars uh, Hammerhead. That's a pretty cool one right there. Um, I actually don't have one of these. Um, this is actually the uh, the OG one from uh, 2014, if you can see down there. Focuses in a little bit. Um, it's a pretty good one. He looks to be in really good condition, too. But, uh, guys, that is all the pops. No, you got one left, buddy. Do you I saved still the have last one, left? one for the beer to pop himself. Look at that. One left. They're still coming. You think they're going to end, but no. They just keep coming. And all this bubble wrap everywhere. <laughs> and a giant box. Now guys, here it is again. The Galactic Convention exclusive uh, Darth Maul. He's still a pretty cool one like he was a few minutes ago when I pulled him out. But, um, <laughs> and I still have him. But uh, he's cool, so definitely he'll be on Macari. And, um, you know, just make sure to, uh, you know, check out my Macari page. I'm going to put a lot of pops up and some uh, sets of some uh, pops and uh, definitely some Toy Story pops. And uh, if you're into Fortnite, there's going to be some Fortnite pops as well. And, um, you know, just wanted to say thank you for all the support. And uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. You know, check out my giveaway videos. And uh, make sure to check out my buddy Dick Star at uh, DickStar.net. It's got some great art and stuff like that. Make sure to check it out. And for now, guys, Beard of Pop, out.